If you have a 2015 to present day Dimension One Spa, Reflection, or Bay Series, your heater has what's called a TCO switch on it that if for any reason a problem happens, like for instance, if your heater relay gets stuck closed and the heater does not shut off and it heats your water up really hot, it trips the little TCO button. If, uh, if your breaker trips, it could trip the button. If you manually shut your breaker off while the spa is heating, it could trip that button also. So it could trip when there's a problem and it could trip when there's no problem at all. And usually what happens when you notice something like this happened is your screen will say heating to whatever temperature you have it set at. So heating to 102, heating to 104, whatever. And the spa does not heat at all. And you take your voltmeter and you check power to the heater and you're getting voltage to the heater, but it's still not heating. So the TCO switch is the reason for this. And this is what it looks like. It is this tiny little white button now this is a brand new heater so the wires aren't on it yet but I'm just using this as an example to show you what it looks like and how to press it while it's installed in the pack without having to take this bottom cover off to look for it. So if you have a reflection spa this is what your heater looks like. If you have a Bay Series spa this is what yours looks like. It wraps around the unit rather than going through the just the bottom of the unit like this um, so but the bottom part with the TCO switch is in the same exact spot for both series of spot so basically when this is installed in the pack it is just like this so that TCO switch is lined up perfectly in between these two little divots right here but it's farther down here literally like right here is where the TCO button is when the heater is installed so if you see that your spa says it's heating but it's obviously not this is most likely the case so what you're gonna do you're gonna shut your breaker off obviously because there are wires going to this one's gonna have power going to it the others not so if you touch it you're gonna shock the crap out of yourself you don't want that so to press the button while it is installed you literally take your finger go behind here and push you're pulling in because the buttons facing that way so you're just doing this basically so you put your finger down you'll feel for this tiny little button and when you push it you will feel a, a little click so you'll know for sure that that was the problem but yeah that's pretty much it shut the breaker off Locate the button, push the button in, turn the breaker back on. Most likely your spa will start heating again. If you do not feel the click, then either your TCO switch is bad or something else is the problem.